In 1945, we established, we had uh, three villages, and we had about maybe 45 boys. And uh, in 1946, the government gave us, actually, after Germans on a border, a nice cottage in Shumava under Bobin. I don't know if it means Bobin is a big hill, uh, forest, uh, it's a beautiful countryside, and so on. And we used to spend summers there. And later on, when I was 16, 17, I became an assistant leader of uh, our uh, district uh, group. And I was especially taking care of cops. I had about 15 young boys, and, and that was my life, you know. I, and um, yeah, it was my life. And in, and I used to take uh, my boys to that summer camp for a couple of weeks, and and it was that cottage was in a beautiful meadows, and there was a little creek next to us, you know, and it was an ideal situation. And why did you like Boy Scouts so much? Why why did it become so big a part of your life? Well, you know, during the Second World War, we cannot have anything like that, and we were receiving, or you could buy a magazine about boy scouting. Uh, it was Mladi Hlasatel. It was a small, you know. And uh, we actually, you know, any young boy has ideals and a dreams and so on. And we were money to Indians and all this stuff. And we want to, you know, express ourselves and so on. But like I said, that uh, Germans were very strict and you cannot participate and we never had anything and, you know, everything was actually university and schools closed down. And when the Second World War was over, of course, that desire of the youth come up and here we were.